Hola a todos, esto es Looking Backstage. En el vídeo de hoy, como podréis ver en la descripción, eh, voy a hacerle una entrevista a Katinka Pasvier, que quien no sabe quién es, es la mujer de Stockhausen y es la que actualmente se encarga de llevar todo lo que es relacionado a los conciertos de música de Stockhausen, el curso de Curtain, que es el curso que se hace en verano sobre música de Stockhausen. En definitiva, todo lo que tiene relación con Stockhausen y su música es ella la que se encarga de ello. Y esta semana pasada he estado formando parte de un proyecto eh, como parte del Festival Dagen Branding, en el cual se tocaba música eh, de bares y de Stockhausen. Y he estado participando en la obra Katinka Gesang y ella pues ha venido a hacernos como de coach para la obra, a decirnos cómo realmente tendría que tocarse, de qué manera, los aspectos teatrales, todo. Aunque todo eso lo veréis en otro vídeo, he estado grabando los ensayos, eh, concierto, un poco de todo, entonces eh, una de las partes será hoy la entrevista y luego creo que habrá dos o tres vídeos más sobre este proyecto. Entonces, bueno, pues quería tener una conversación con ella y compartirla con vosotros. Así que nada, vamos a empezar. So I would like to start yeah. uh, looking for Stockhausen in Google, yeah. and then let's see what we find. So we find Carly de Stockhausen was a German composer, widely acknowledged by critics as one of the most important but also controversial composers of the 20s and early 21st century. Yes. What do you think about it? Right. <laughs> That's right. He was a great innovator, so he changed the music after 1950, totally. And he has, been, uh, he has invented so many different uh, new ways of creating music, electronic music, but also composing in a totally different way for different instruments. He made percussion <laughs> as a solo instrument. Yeah. The first solo work was Cyclus. So, uh, and specialization of sounds using electronics, live electronics, uh, so many inventions. And uh, have you ever heard about anything that was totally wrong about this person? Because you can read a uh, lot of most, most of it is wrong. Especially what they say about the person. Hmm. Because they, they say he was very strange, mystic, or uh, not from this world, but he was a wonderful craftsmanship. Wonderful to work with, fantastic person, humor, but very precise. He knew exactly what he wanted, so he was not easy to work with because he never said it's a beautiful bug. He just said, no, this is too loud, this is too short, this is to the point. And yeah. many people don't like that. Yeah. So then they say he's difficult, he's. Uh, but he was just a, a fantastic musician, but perhaps not so tactful as made some conductors or other composers who just say, oh, fantastic, fantastic. No, he just only said it's fantastic when it really was fantastic. It was very it seldom. Was nice. <laughs> yeah, so you knew exactly, but he was always searching for himself. It was not never personal, but it's all, always about music. And he was always correcting until the last moment to get everything the way he had heard it in his head. He knew he had great ears. He was an uh, amazing and what would be your advice for people who first approach the house? Because I remember the first time yeah. it was with my analyst teacher yeah. and we were seeing Gruppen. Yeah. And then it was really complex for complex. almost everyone. Yeah. And then the, um, in my fourth year I played Tear Christ and yeah. I asked uh, oh, few musicians and every time I say like I'm playing a Stockhausen, they were like really afraid yeah. about it. So what would be your advice for these musicians who don't know yeah. Stockhausen? Just be open and uh, Stockhausen composed oh, more than 360 pieces and every work is totally different. So it's very normal that uh, some pieces perhaps you don't like the first time, other ones you like, so it depends also on what you are used to. Hmm. And this music um, also demands of the listener to a little bit more effort also to be open and if you are interested uh, then read the score that helps or hear the piece uh, more often, difficult pieces you have to hear more often 
and then it becomes very natural. But we have played stop houses for children, and they just love it. Yeah. Because they are more open, and we, the grown-up musicians, always think we have to understand something. And what is your favorite piece from a <laughs> Or your favorite piece in general? Ktin of course. I have many, many favorite pieces. Um, I love Inori, the big orchestra work, mm. very much. Uh, there are many pieces of Stockhausen. All the works for flute, of course. I love them. And not from Mr. Hauser? <laughs> difficult. <laughs> it's difficult. Of course, I li like to listen to sometimes to other music also. And I was brought up as a normal trained classical musician. But I never forget when I first heard the con Stockhausen concerts here in this hall and in the Riddersaal there were and different case from Barenzaal. And when I heard this music and saw these musicians playing by heart with uh, beautiful costumes, movements, and the beauty of the music that struck me so deeply, more than normal classical music. Or, yeah. And also, I, I played a lot of new music, other new music, but I never felt this beauty. So, for me, this world is enough. <laughs> okay. yeah. And I have um, a personal question. Yeah. Like, what was your first impression about the Stockholm? So, the first time you met him here, yeah. what was your first impression? Um, I'll never forget, I um, I had prepared a woodwind quintet Zeitmaße and it was for the opening concert of this whole festival. It was in the Gemeentelijk Museum in, here in The Hague. That was a room. And then I saw this man entering and I just saw, I never forget this picture, just a huge person and a lot of light. And I just saw him. Something changed later after the first impression? Uh, no, <laughs> he has always been uh, yeah, well, the love of my life. I mean, and we have worked wonderfully together for 25 years. I was always there in the music studios, also when he was composing electronic music. I was in all rehearsals he did, uh, lots of concerts over the whole world. And we were always together, and I loved the way he, how he rehearsed with people. And to be there when he composed, you know, so it has been always a huge impact on my life. Yeah. And the last thing, uh, René told us about an anecdote about the aha, uh -huh, uh -huh. aha. <laughs> Could you tell us a little bit about it? Oh, it says now in the score, the, these are magical words. But it, we were uh, in Kenya when he was composing Katinka's yeah. Kazang. And in the evenings there was a disco where we were dancing. And there was some kind of stupid uh, music, and we always heard, uh huh, uh huh. And then, so I was just teasing Stockhouse every time he said something. I said, uh huh. And he said, well, you, when you say this one time more, you will see. So I said, uh huh. <laughs> and the next day, I got my next line for the poor Katinka's Kazakh, and it was this, uh huh, uh huh, composed. So now, for my whole life, I have to repeat to these words. <laughs> But there are also other anecdotes because they, uh, the number seven, this. It was, he was composing, he was sitting in the. Uh, yeah, it was a lounge with the, for breakfast and he was composing there and it was glass. And at a, a certain point, a beautiful bird, blue, yellow, green, flew against the window and was dying and made this sound. <laughs> and then he composed this for section seven. So there was a. So I always feel this uh, very sad moment. So he always put things of every day life also in music. Yeah. So that was it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Pues esto ha sido la la entrevista. Espero que os haya gustado. Si es así, suscribiros al canal y manita arriba para saber que que os ha gustado o no, y así saber si continúo las semanas siguientes con vídeos o los intercalo, o ver a ver cómo lo hago. Y nada, nos vemos en el siguiente. Que paséis un buen día, una buena semana, o lo que sea que vayáis a pasar. ¡Chao!